Typhoon Noir weakened into a tropical storm on Thursday as it moved away from Taiwan. But its periphery continued to bring showers to many parts of the island, particularly in Ilan and Greater Taipei. Forecasters say the rains will start to ease after Friday to be followed by a spell of heavy rainfall in mid-June. Typhoon Mawar's retreat led to the formation of an intriguing pod-like cloud formation captured by Hualien residents. This lenticular cloud was caused by sinking air. The Central Weather Bureau says Mawar has reached the seas near the Ryukyu Islands and weakened into a tropical storm, but its periphery is still bringing showers to northern Taiwan. The green and red regions of the periphery are primarily concentrated over northern Taiwan, especially over the mountains in the north and Ilan. The CWB has issued heavy rain advisories for Ilan, Shinju, and areas north of Shinju and Greater Taipei. Residents should take note. Miali and areas south of Miali are under this green section and may experience localized showers due to the influence of the periphery. The weather in other areas should be more stable. The storm's periphery has replenished northern Taiwan's Xinshan and Mingde reservoirs. In central Taiwan, the Sun Moon Lake Reservoir is approaching full capacity. Zhengwen Reservoir received more than a million tons of water in its catchment area, which have raised the supply to 6.82 percent. In a post on social media, CWB head Chen Mingdian warned that if easterly winds continue to prevail after Mawar's departure, it could be a sign that this year's plum rain season is over. As for a more long-term forecast, we are seeing signs of heavier precipitation in Taiwan in mid-June. What's unclear is whether there will be an impact from southwesterly winds or from the intertropical convergence zone. But still, be warned that in mid-June, we will see more intense precipitation. Plum rain season typically lasts until the end of June, but forecasters are scanning the skies for signs of an early end.